Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, earlier this month, I posted a video that Chrome could soon allow you to install any site as a web app, which is currently not the case. And that's because in Chrome Canary, which is a preview version, two new flags had become available in Chrome Canary 123, which back then was the latest preview version. And although the flags were not working, when I posted that video, which will be down below in the description, uh, it could improve the accessibility of web apps in the browser. Now go check that video out um, if you'd like some more info, but just to let you know that it seems now that uh, Google has been doing a little bit of work since I posted a week or two ago, and now in Chrome Canary 124, which is now the latest preview, uh, it seems that the install menu, the install dialog, is a little bit different now when installing any site as a web app as opposed to uh, installing sites that can be installed as web apps in the stable version. So if we head over to stable, which is currently on version 122, and we just kind of get the process going by heading over, as an example, to X. Yeah, the install button when you click on it. This is currently what the install dialog looks like in the stable version when you are installing a site that can be installed as a web app. Now if we head over to uh, the preview version and I do exactly the same thing, just to give us a comparison between the current and the so-called new universal installation dialog. So if we just head over to this quickly to Twitter, there we go, uh, install X. This is now currently what the new universal install menu looks like. And I actually think I quite like it. I know it's a little bit bigger, but I think it's Google trying to bring your attention to the fact that when you click on that button, that site is now going to be installed as a web app. And the difference between the two, as we can see, is besides obviously it being a little bit larger and wider in the stable, you've got install and cancel. And if we head back, to the preview you've just got install and i actually want to see what happens when i install that just to give us a good idea okay so there's nothing else that's appearing and it's the same process but that's just a quick overview as to what that install dialog will look like when this if and when this feature rolls out to the stable version but go check that other video out i'll show you how to enable the flags and as you can see a little bit more work has been done and although it's a little bit bigger as mentioned, I actually think I like that new look. It just makes it a lot more kind of in your face that that site is being installed as a web app, and I think that's a nice move. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.